Hi, Mike. What's up, Mike, tonight? I think I'm Kratos again. Kratos and um, Freya. Um, probably not. Hi, buddy. You need to go to bed. Sleep schedule. I love you, though, Kenny. Get some sleep, buddy. Five on purple site. Oh, okay. Have fun, Mike. You what? I know. It was Trey, but I don't think I gained them. They just re ah. they just upped their supportage. They just re supported. Ah. Shut up, Silva. I missed you, bud. Hold on, you guys. Let me say hi to my dog, because I haven't said hi to him since I came home, and he's freaking out wanting me to give him some help. I'm coming. I'm coming.
puppy. He's not normally like that. <laughs> Okay. Can I go here? Let's say where's Freya? I've been gaining followers like crazy, you guys. It's crazy. Every time I sign in, there's like eight new followers. Between eight and eighty, it's insane. Oh wow. What is this? It's ice. Nope, I'm not oh, selling it's them. fine. I got nothing but time. Oh, What's this is this? ah, a memory of war. You could use this as a training arena if you like. You'll just be fighting the recollections of enemies. They won't be able to harm you. That's kind of cool. What is this? Ravens, the ones we've been destroying. Odin's little spies. This is their afterlife? Free army. Free of the father. Our half lives now belong to no other. The father. Odin, I presume? I don't know. But there's definitely something more going on here. must have created these creatures but how i haven't the foggiest they came after my time with them but perhaps we should continue to destroy any of odin's ravens we find they're not good for strength they're like shitty strength wise So destroying the ravens free their spirits somehow. Good to know. Free. Well, free of Odin's control anyway. Wait. See, it suck. Their defense on him is like really good, but like, and the luck. I don't know. If I like my own stuff. I've opened everything I can with him. In 
Hi, Cedric. How you doing, buddy? Good night. All right, I need 48, 38, 28. Yeah, so I need like 48 ravens, basically. I'm gonna go do this practice thing. I wanna see what this is. Draugr training. There, the sparring arena allows you to test and hone your skills in combat. In the arena, you have infinite health and accelerated cooldowns. No, there is no XP or hack silver gain in this arena. There's Draugr training, Grim training, Light Elf training. So there's, what's the point of it? I don't get it. It's just a waste of time. Do we have to be here? Creeping me out, all these poor bastards with their souls cut up. Love you too, buddy. Why do you stare? He's gonna be fine, you know. I do not. He's getting what he needs. He is in danger. And being with you, he was safe as houses, huh? Never got close to dying. Not even once? I did not come to you for a lecture. I know. It's on the house. My new customer loyalty program. We will speak no more of it. Oh, he pissed him off. What is this? The Crucible. <laughs> oh, that's right. Okay. I might go ahead and do that. I wonder if I can I though? Ooh, wow. Certain the trace could not still be in Midgard. I was just there and found no trace. If Odin invited him, he must have provided a way. No, that is not the only explanation. Tell me where we find these Norns. I discovered some of their threads near the frozen lake. I stashed one for spellcrafting, but we may also use it to find them. Just remember, they really don't want to be found. Well, at least things will be difficult for a change. We should take your sled and head to the lake. Well, thank you. Midgard. How I've missed the freezing gusts and constant radar attacks. Well, that's because they believe Kratos is responsible for Fimble Winter and that killing him will end it. Where would they get an idea like that? From me, of course. Of course. I don't know what you're looking for out here, but when you want to find the Norns, we'll need to get back to your wolf sled. We should get down to the wolves, brother.
Come. Quiet. She is a friend. Now. Better they get this from you. You don't want your face bit off. Once the wolves have the scent of the Norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. Mm. I will open the gate. <laughs> Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? They are wolves. And matted fur leads to disease. Take care of them, and they'll take care of you. Can I brush their hair? Brother, what exactly do you intend to ask the Norns? How I may find my son. Nothing more. You don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy? Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? When Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants, Fay herself, had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet, who we would fight. All of it, as it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not the problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it earns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this no further. I thought he didn't know. It sure is. Did he see it and destroy it? Keegan. I'm sorry, I know my straight streams have been late. Hopefully, in the next week, they'll go back to being at nine. Aw. Thank you. I feel like I look like shit. I need a bath. <laughs>
loving this game. So, I have RE4, the remake. I can play it with the DLC and everything. My brother has it out there in the building. I don't have it. He has it. And he's already, uh, he has the digital copy. He got his physical copy today and was like, you can, you can play it and whatever. You can have the code. But when we get done with this, I'm not jumping into it. We're going to play um, Mario. We might play it after Mario. I don't know. I really... Oh, where is my Oxalot? There it is. I really want to play Trag from, on, on the computer. But depending on, like, how things go and, like, how I'm feeling after I play um, Super Mario, if it takes me longer than I, I'm wanting it to, then we'll jump into RE4. I haven't really watched any of the gameplay except for I watched like two seconds of it when Jack was playing it. And I can't really judge it because it's not fair. Because I had, like, I've watched it two, for two seconds, two minutes, whatever. But I will say this. I don't like the merchant's voice. Like, I heard the merchant talking, and I just was like, no. Why couldn't they get the same guy? Or why couldn't they, like, copy-paste, you know, like, take the old one and put it on, I don't know. There has to be somebody in this world whose voice is closer to that guy's. than the person that they got. I hate when I get lipstick on my teeth. <coughs> Shut up, dogs. <coughs> Hi, Hiru. But yeah, this is the only thing I don't like about it that I've seen, which I haven't really seen a lot of the gameplay anyway. I just saw the part where he was talking to him and I was like, aw, his voice is so different. Why? I know I'm supposed to ride the damn dogs through here, but I'm not, okay? I like to look around. Ice. Yeah, it's fucking ice. Now that we are on the lake, how will we find the Norns? Nice. Watch the wolves come up. See how their heads point the way? Well, 
The Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. Raiders have made themselves quite at home. Not sure I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Secret. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. Huh? But I heard something. Long before I believed it. The Valkyrie Queen. An ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. She's so loyal, wise, clever, tall. Mm-hmm. Doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. culture of raiders that a group such as this may en entirely turn over the focus of their devotion from blood to fire while the maintaining such while maintaining such mainstream raider traditions as their castes of animal what Must we grow to a custom to the ordinary pains from the slingshots of ranged ra raider scouts? We are blessed to encounter this varia, who instead threw fire all over the bloody place. <laughs> and I rescued ours from such an encampment. That was... kind of you. The cold raiders have been a blight on this land. The way they've abused its creatures. We should do something. Thank you for the share. Up to you, brother. If the Norns know the future, no doubt they'll expect us to show up a bit. single-handedly shut down all the cosmos night all the wine oh god i miss you too buddy waiting let me do some light reading <laughs> hi jordan oh. This thread of fate we are tracing. It's not somebody's life, if that's what you mean. Sent you a photo of my Kratos and God of War Ragnarok on PS4 on your profile. Oh, hold on. On Facebook or like on here? Ah! What are you barking at, Simba? Nothing. I don't have any messages. It can't be on here, hold on. Yeah. 
Oh, it's right here. Oh, cool. The book you keep pulling out to read it is in a way. I'm not pulling out. I'm picking up stuff. And I have to read it. How does a, do a Reg team member shut down Calzones? I didn't see your previous live game stream because I was sleeping. It's okay, David. It's not that big a deal. He looks cool. When I get a chance to upgrade my um, shield, my, my the one that I got from my wife or whatever, that's the shield I'm gonna use. The Norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well. The Norns in the well. No, the well of Earth. Their home is hard to explain. It's in no fixed place, and princes come and go. A place wholly under their influence, where the intangible becomes tangible. Like being inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in each other's minds? Not so sure I like the sound of that. Aw, Cedric said he loves you, Dustin. Aww. I'm in Midgard too, just after the main mission, exploring and killing. I'm not sure where I'm at. Have you? <laughs> he said, hey. You could say hey. He what could... up, Jimmy? Um. I'm, I'm looking for the norm. Norns. The norns. I love you, Pookie. Yep. I fucking knew there was one there somewhere over here. Mamiya, have you encountered these Norns? Not personally. Freya's right, they have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin made his share of efforts. Wouldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. Why are you still in Midgar today? Freya, ah! yes. you mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the Norns last time? To be honest, the details are hazy. Like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son's fate, which only made me more determined to try. Brother, what of your story? You faced the fates of your homeland, yeah? The legends I heard about the ghost of Sparta were surely exaggerated. Exaggerated? Oh, not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part. The part where it said you traveled back in time itself to win a battle once lost. It strains credulity, obviously. I mean, a rumor about Thor knocking the World Serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. It is the truth. The threads of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. That's the most dangerous and irresponsible thing I've ever heard. These Norns have no such magic. 
nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. Aye, can you imagine? If it existed, Odin would have it. And if Odin had it, we'd be five shades more fucked than we are already. Hold. The wolves are distracted. Kratos. A raider encampment. Shall we take care of them, brother? Yeah. Thanks, Boogie Bear. <laughs> I'm just focused, I'm sorry. <laughs> to be honest, I'm exhausted. Hi James, one day there be a God of War movie. I, that would be fucking badass. That would be amazing. Just imagine Kratos riding the sleigh wearing a Santa suit. <laughs> oh, that's good. Enemy behind you, Kratos! Good night, Jimmy. Go! Go! Well, obviously. Otherwise, it's just someone that told you. Ignore me. I don't use my brain dollars. Hi, Gary. Howdy. Happy, happy. Never mind. I don't want that kind of shit. Facebook is too fucking strict. Go! <laughs> I knew it, that's why Santa stopped coming. <laughs> that fat bastard owes me a lot of fucking money. Let's just put it that way. That su that some bitch owes me a lot of money. You got a lot of nerve. Guys, I I don't want to talk a lot about my personal life, and I'm not going to, but I just, I do have a lot going on right now, and it is why I haven't been able to uh, be go, to go live, be in, it's why I haven't been able to go live at nine like I normally would. Cause I'm not getting home until like nine and um, I'm taking care of something that's urgent in my family. Hi Ron! And just want you guys to like kind of keep me and my my family in your prayers and like your up or your thoughts or whatever. like I have this whole community of people and I have my family and I have my kids and I have Dustin and like sometimes you know you just feel like alone and I know that I'm not it just kind of feels like it and like when I come on here it reminds me that I'm not and it makes me feel better especially knowing that I have all of you amazing people supporting me and behind me and like, it's very personal, so I'm not going to get into, like, like what it is, because it's not, I, I just, I don't feel like it would be right if I did. Thank you, Jimmy.
just know that hopefully within the next week my schedule will get back to normal life and for me and my family will get back to normal and hopefully it'll stay that way um but just bear with me like i said for like the next week because i am going to try to stream as often as i can um i can't promise it'll be before by nine o'clock it'll probably be it and if it's not by nine it'll be later if there's a stream at all that night like it depends on how rough that day is um but i'm doing the best i can hi lona i have a bunch of stuff i have to do right now i cannot miss it as it happens i hope it's working out for you all captain boomerang throw his act up problems i wish yeah i know i'm just saying i don't want you guys to think that like i'm not streaming and like that i'm missing out on purpose because i am trying to get a better schedule i i want to have a good schedule where i can spend time with you guys all the time but like there's just so much going on right now it's hard to get to be here and be alive by nine o'clock But some stuff is kind of winding down a little bit, but not completely. And when it completely winds down, that's when the schedule should get back to normal. I wish I had fucking Kratos in my life. Throw axes around and get shit done. But yeah. Just know that you guys right now are huge mental uh, therapy therapeutic for me. And you guys remind me that... I'm not alone. I have all these amazing people behind me. It's okay. Don't be sorry. I have all these amazing people behind me. And it makes me feel better. Like, like, I don't know. It makes me smile. So. I love all of you guys. I know they do. And that's why I'm here. Because it, it, it lifts me up. So I can... Be uplifting for other people in my life that need me right now so just know that you guys are doing me a big favor by being here hanging out with me making me laugh making me smile hi Michael so that way I can keep that like with me and and help push it out to the people in my life that need it you know <laughs> Like, no matter how much I know that I'm not alone, everybody does sometimes. Like, when they, you have something big in your life going on, you, you just feel empty and alone. And you have all these people that are like, you're not alone, you're not alone. But it doesn't change, like, that feeling, you know? Like, that empty, hopeless... I'm loving it. It's amazing. It's, like, phenomenal. But yeah, it doesn't change that feeling inside, like... No matter how many times everybody's like, oh, well, I'm here. You've got me. Yeah. That doesn't make the feeling go away. Don't cry. Please don't cry. Because it's going to be okay. I see something. It's going to be okay. And it's going to get better. Just rocky at the moment. You know? It's all in my head. chest <laughs> La -da -da -da. what do you see that thing I just picked up they still whine can smell more danger. Uh, the wolves fear that which can no longer hurt them. The horrors of our past can be inextricable from the present. You have to understand that. True. I 
I don't want to go the right way. What is that? is not about altering events, yeah? <laughs> I would not ask them to change the past even if they could. I only a... want information. And that... I'm a damn good driver. You can ask my children. Quite dangerous enough <laughs> in my experience. Oh! He won't be happy to see us. How do I get up there? Hold on. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is it. Sorry, I'm not setting in the car. Oh, you kissed my butt. talking to people and help me in a lot of ways. That's amazing. I'm really happy that that's helping you. Oh man, I was hoping that he had found a different coconut mid Let's see. A troll we encountered in Midgar. The winds carried its stench so far I could smell it long before I saw it. Fighting these beasts in the dead winter is one of the few ways to keep warm without a fire. I appreciate this. However, my we may run out of trolls. Armor. This is so dumb. That is so fucking beautiful. I'm sorry, but y'all yeah, it is. Stunning. Cured me of my appetite, but damn if I can't stop thinking about the smell of dear stew. Awakened a fair few culinary cravings, did. Black pudding, haggis and neeps. Oh, porridge and honey. What about you, brother? Any pre-fimble winter foods you're aching for? Olives. The hell's an olive? <laughs> Isn't that the spear from Tyr's statue? Fucking olive is. Wish for peace. Be ready for war. Well, that's astute of the elves. Tyr never sought war, but he knew he had to be ready for it. Aye. Wish for peace. Be ready for war. Found etched on a spear of the statue of Tyr. I agree with the sentiment. 
Best be armed than not. Impressive looking weapon, isn't it? It is big. It is big. Kind of look he wanted you to kill his tag along. What tag along? What? Freya, I can't kill her. Wish I could. to be a sculptor from the southern lands. Hi, John! Now, where have we seen an artifact like that before? Okay, a sculptor from the southern empire. Now, that is a civilization I would like to visit. If Tyr's writings are to be believed, the southern gods are said to possess unparalleled wisdom and generosity. Their ruler of the heavens apparently saw fit to gift humanity with advances like writing, farming, the calendar and sciences. Imagine that, a deity who wishes to share knowledge rather than hoard it. Equally, I wouldn't wish to ever draw that the ear of such a pantheon. I've heard their god of death takes great pleasure in torturing expired souls with fire and water. Though I can no longer feel pain, I imagine he'd find a way to make my current situation rather unpleasant. The chick that rides with him is just... Yeah, you can't hurt her. I don't know why. Here's Bolt. This guy can't watch. No. Nothing. Not a damn thing. That must be Tyr's helmet from his statue. Win minds, not wars. Tyr understood the greatest fight of them all was the battle. Etch on the helmet of the statue of Tahira, a radically philosophy of a god of war. Okay, driver, kiss my butt. <laughs> For people's hearts and minds. Too bad Tyr has no interest in doing either these days. Okay, driving a car is nothing like driving on this game. Look, who the fuck wants luck? I just want my strength to be badass. And it's a level five. Fuck that. Another coal raider camp. Kratos. We should do something about them. What do you think I'm doing, bitch? I'm literally walking in here. Let's try 
Things will cease their whining. Now there's another camp. Is though, yeah, I'll have it. I will. <laughs> oh, that's bad. The fuck ass. Yeah, I like the one I got. Tired of your lack of empathy for your own wolves. It's Demos, isn't it, brother? I should not have told you, Demos. You see yourself in these wolves, in their fear. Let us keep moving. It came from that way. Oh, it's one of those bitch puppies. The oarsmen. Ugh. A monument to conquerors. Made some lovely warships, though. Oh, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Don't take slip dogs to DMV. <laughs> I'm not. Sindri. And that's where he talked to, uh, what's his name? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, because see there, Atreus, no, it was right there. That's where he talked to him, right there. I don't know what's going to come out of this bitch. Hold on. Oh, stronger. <laughs> Oh, there's not. They're elk. I felt that one, brother. Hi, Jesse. <laughs> Well, good. I like you being here. It's a Power Ranger chick. Or not. I just somehow seen it. Thank you.
Are you kidding me? I about just died. Sure, why not? Oh! Nice! What is a guiding light and an artif uh, artifact? Oh wow. Oh, on the game, um... Wait, what's this? Hmm? Oh, okay, this is where a train is supposed to Um... Diablo music puts you to sleep. <laughs> huh? Yeah, this is where a train is shot that arrow thing. Yeah, I remember that. You won't believe it, Moon. Nice. This crest belongs to Fjotorlund. Oh, this is going to take me somewhere else. I don't want to go somewhere else. Fjotorlund, you see? Now that's where Sigrun was from. I don't know what this area is. Hold on. I'll tell you in just a second. I was playing RE4 all day since like 9 in the morning and I ate a huge dinner that I put the other. It's a good way to get it. Hi, Neil. How are you, buddy? How are you? The cousin of the flame, these beasts are, have opted to utilize ice in their attacks rather than hot headed relatives. <laughs> I'm gonna play it, not immediately. We're gonna finish. 
there's this definitely. And then after this, um, uh, Super Mario 64, and then we might play it. Maybe. We'll see. Enemies down. Tyr used to talk about how heavy the cost of war was compared to its bounties. He felt like it was his responsibility to avoid it. Kind of. Okay, so I got. Does in fact. One more artifact to find over here. There's some artifact over here that I'm missing. The baby has opened everyone now. I think it's one. And that shores of the nine. That's not the right one. That's not the right one either. Oh wait, yeah, it is. It's right over here. Get over there. Hold on. Is Jesse, are you talking about for Ragnar like um RE4 or are you talking about It's over there. I don't know how to get over there. <laughs> Thank you. That was sweet. You didn't have to do that. How do I get over there? So, how do I do that? go 
to... Okay. This is where I need to go. Bitch! I've never seen craftsmanship like this before. Can't imagine how old it is. For the first time, and feel free to mark this down as it is unlikely to happen again, I'm at a loss. I've simply never seen anything like this. I've clearly carved, it's clearly carved from stone, but I don't recognize the craftsmanship. The craftsmanship is old, that much is clear, but I can't even begin to fathom from whence it came or why. Well, that's only particularly true, given the statu statuette's measurements, shall we say. I suspect this may be a fertility idol of some sort. Well, it's got some titties. she got some titos. I'll come back to that other place in a few minutes because it's it's a side quest too and I'm already on like I'm doing oh, there they are. Um, see I've got to go do that I just did that one I don't know why it's still on here Oh no, that's not it. Yeah, that's that's yeah, I gotta, I gotta go. I'm gonna go finish the stall going real quick. And I gotta go through these gates up here. I'm I'm betting money. Or no, probably not. Just right here. I bet. I bet it's right here. Thank you for the uh, tip, Jimmy. I really appreciate it. Oh shit, I know where I'm at. I know what this is too. Fuck, fuck, fuck.
for the death of her family, and has been haphazardly wreaking her vengeance on anything within arm's reach. Even death didn't stop her. I know. Oh, hell yeah! I can upgrade my Flames of Chaos. Yes, sir. Um, let me see. <laughs> Is it that gonna tell me, like, the completion? Oh, the driver hole. I got it. Another coal raider can. We should do something about them and put your wolves at ease. <laughs> you know, I'm loving this gameplay. empty. I'm a badass, so don't let that fool you, okay? Oh, Holy fuck! Fire, no Get shit, fire. Sherlock! <laughs> Who's the alpha? <laughs> 
the one the leader of the coal riders will threaten the wolves of midgar no longer atreus has grown close to specky svana and svana since their rescue but over time i have come to rely on them as well they are loyal and well-mannered for the most part i hope i have been able to put their troubled minds at ease now that the olaf will never lay hands on them again you captured the wolves before you freed them i do not know Regardless, they should draw some comfort from his death. I'm gonna find out in just a second. Um, ooh, wait. Why would I want to trade? That was cool. This literally has more than. No. I see that one. I see that one. Oh shit. Yeah. Jump down in the hole, you dumb. <laughs> Okay, I gotta find this last one because I don't see, I'm not seeing it. Oh, I see it. I see it. I see it.
bad. Okay. Enough gloating. I got it all. How long did that look? Seems like you haven't seen that corner. You can't go down there. It, it was just um like a puzzle. And that hole is just the hole that I blew open. Uh, I did it all. Okay, I need to go to my codex. Or my goals, sorry. Favors. Patti. They're still scared. Not of the raiders. Two were girls, and the, the other one was a boy. But ha! <laughs> Besties. Look at that! See the fish? Svanas have served us well and been welcome companions on this long on this leg of our journey. I see their need for affection. I feel a desire to protect them and bring them comfort. I am pleased that we were able to rid the realm of the raiders who slayed their kin. If it was if it is within my power, I will let no wolf suffer the same fate. Aww, he's such a softy. <laughs> Fishies. Fishy, fishy, fishy. I thought I already did this. Why does it keep doing this? That's annoying because I just picked that up. Let me load it. Yeah, that's right. It should be alright. It should be gone. It's been doing that. This is like the fourth time it's done that. Is that a frozen lightning bolt? My fight with Thor ended there. That's where you landed. It's gone. No wonder there's bits of tear statue all over the lake. Some debris over there. I'm guessing from Tears Poor Statue. Sucks. Takes my strength down by 41. No. Defend the peace. 
Well, I think that's the last of it. Doubtful we'll find any more interesting bits. I always admired the love Tyr inspired. Where I come from, gods of war are not revered in such a way. Not all gods of war are the same, brother. No, they are not. I'm gonna talk to Sindri or whoever the hell's over here real quick. I scouted ahead. The lake's crawling with raiders. Be careful. Oh, he looks so pitiful with his boo-booed head. Why are there two? There's my lightning bolt. I don't think I can get there yet. me for a little bit. Come hang out with me again. Hi. What's up, Jack? Thank you for helping me out with the game a little bit. is what's left of Kalthalun. Sigrun spoke of growing up with these people before she joined the Valkyries. Why aren't you sleeping, boy? Looks like there's a staircase on the other side. Hmm. Looks like there's a fucking chest on the other side, bitch. What are you talking about? Me her 
kingdom housed a great treasury filled with the spoils of our family's conquests. Perhaps this outpost holds some of that treasure. Is that all she told you, Mimi? Did she say well? No, just that they kept it hidden. Hidden is my specialty. <laughs> Get over whenever what's his name punched that the chest like he was trying to be like his dad and punched that chest and he was like ah that was fucking hilarious <laughs> I heard you bitch. Could be worth pulling on those chains, no? That's a fair few birds you've hunted. I wonder if it might be worth visiting the raven tree. Yeah, because I got 28, but I'm going to wait till I get at least 38. There it is. The other staircase. What lock that key belongs to? No lock. It is broken. Not broken. It's just split in half. Perhaps we could find its partner. Oh, an artifact from the River Empire. Never been missed. A symbol representing the concept of life comes from the land I've long. I've longed to visit. The civilization from which this artifact originates is said to be both ancient and technologically advanced. They worship half-human, half-animal gods who, from what I've heard, rule with wisdom and humility. That said, one should never trust gossip, especially not when it comes to gods. Give me a second.
You know what's funny? I've always wondered. And like, I'm serious, so you can laugh at me if you want to, but like, wouldn't it be funny if like, we all worship different gods. Like a lot of people worship the same. There's Christianity, um, you know, I can't think of all the freaking Catholic. There's all kinds of different religions all across the, across the world. What if all the gods are like real? And they're just like, I'm gonna like make my own group of people to see if I can get these people to believe in me more than they believe in y'all. And then like some of them group together. That's why there's like, you know, the Greek mythology where there's like a group. They're like, oh yeah, we're just all gonna work together to see if we can get more people. The more of us that band together, the more people that might believe. Like. Hi, Django. But yeah, it's like a giant bet. Like, could you imagine? That would be crazy, right? I bet I could get more people to believe in me than you can you. And then, like, most of the world's Christian because they're scared of hell. Yeah, that's lovely. At least in my, where I'm from, it is. <laughs> There's lore. One more artifact. Oh, the lore's Perhaps right those here. runes over there can shed some light. What? No. She never mentioned. Woe to the great princess Sigrun. Her heart is broken and her mind may follow. She committed a sin for which there can be no redemption. She loved the wrong man. Handsome of face, congenial of, of smile. He was perfect except for his name, King Helgi. Sigrun's father, King Hogni, would never approve of such a marriage for one simple reason. This was the name of his old enemy. So strong was Hogni's hatred of Helgi that he would never allow the man into his home. But Sigrun loved him still, and so she endeavored to convince her father that love should be, could be, stronger than hatred. She was mistaken. That's sad. Considering she was right. Um, I need one more artifact. So Oh my god, the sea is so stupid. Oh, 
Damn, that was sweet. Yes, heck to yeah. Another artifact here. Where am I? Midgard, the oarsman. Two artifacts. Okay, I got that one. Nice. Okay, so I was right how I looked everywhere, except for when I pulled. I would have found it because I was about to walk around back around anyway. Let's see if I missed it up here. Hi, Bedhead. I know that's you. I know that name anywhere. <laughs> Poetry. Delight. Delightful. Three more. In which Cavicera lies a poem of oil slick rotting flesh. Horses of steel and oil wait, horses of steel and oil and leather. Brothers who fight and fall together. They rise from beneath a new day dawns. The future has teeth and yesterday's gone. Why does the future have teeth? <laughs> I mean, I know he wanted to drive, but like, the future doesn't need to. It was good like it was, homeboy. Home skillet. Yes, there's my friend. I'm gravy, baby. How you been? Amir, what did those runes say? Secret. I loved another. A king named Helgi. Seems they were madly in love. But her parents wouldn't let them marry. Oh, come, Mimir. You really didn't think you were her first love, did you? Aye. Suppose I did. Yeah. 
Me too. Got a lot going on at the moment. But it's it's relaxing once the weekend comes around, you know? Is that the strawberries and pure dark pepper? That's my fave. It is. And I can only get it at Sheets, but I <laughs> they think I'm crazy when I come in there walking out with 12 bottles. But like, hey, I can't find it anywhere else. Leave me alone. Okay? Like people look at me and I'm standing there with like 12 bottles of this like this and people are just staring and I'm just like what are you looking at I have a problem and I don't care to admit it I can't order it off of Walmart like I do the Walmart delivery thing and like I have to wait like eight like a week or something if I was to order like I don't know it's like the Walmart that are uh, near me don't have the strawberries and cream and stuff and besides, I don't think I want to drink it out of a can anyway. I prefer it out of the bottle. Am I going the right way? cream soda one I do but this one has become my favorite <laughs> Okay, so when the the cream soda one came out, I was drinking that for a little while, but I kind of got bored with it. So I went back to regular Dr. Pepper, and now I am strictly on strawberries and cream. And I don't think I'm going to get bored with this one like I did the cream soda. Like, this is so good. And they're not getting rid of it. This is not limited edition. This is, like, permanent and stock. I got a disease that is so I love it. It's really, really good. I'm all for exploring the area. Hi, One Eye. It is. It's my favorite. I've been drinking it every day. Be clear. It's down there we'll find the Norns. What's that outpost? <laughs> Thank you. If I don't have it, you don't need it. What can I make for you? I thought I had one. Whatever you need. Hi, Josh. I thought earlier I got something. To where I could upgrade it.
Whenever you need it. I did the Draugr hole. I should have. I thought I got a chaos thing. At your service. I don't understand. That's the one I want to upgrade. I'll disinfect my tools. I know I got one whenever I fought them. I won't take that personally. Mamir, look. Another Fjotalund marking. Aye, this place must have been part of Sigrun's kingdom. A first outpost preceding further expansion. This irk in my nerve, because I know I did Another crane. There's an artifact here, two lore, another raven, and a legendary chest. Another sleeping beast, the handiwork of Alvi Stonefoot. You can come visit, Maurice. Seems it only rotates in the other direction. Oh, you think I'm sad to see Seagram's homeland in such a terrible state. You know, Maria, if you want to take a tour of the kingdom, you might not like it again. Oh, you loved another before me. There are worse things to discover about someone you love. Yes, there certainly are. She knows something. Oh shit, that means we're finally gonna meet in person. I mean, that doesn't. If you're nearby, then yes. And if I have ways to get to where you are, hopefully, hopefully I'll have like. I don't drive, so someone would have to take me to 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 you. But yeah, potentially.
I don't bite, don't worry. Listen, you crazy ass hoe. Ah, oh, don't be nervous. I won't hurt you. This is so dumb. Like, I don't have the stuff to do it yet. Did I not just pick that up? A musical instrument from your homeland, isn't it? Can you play? A stringed instrument, a lyre, to be precise. Kratos says he knows how to play, but refuses to do so, which means he's either lying, possible, or determined to deprive me of a good time, also possible. Though, come to think of it, this is probably one of the few surviving artifacts from his homeland. Plucking the lyre strings might well take his mind back to that place. Thank you. That may well be on a journey. That may be. That may well be a journey that he's not ready to go on. Well, there you are. Yes. Well. There's one more lore and another and a yeah. legendary test. No. <laughs> I read that, didn't I? Yeah. Yes. Hi, Walter. Is it a 
pug raid? Do I got a pug raid on my hand? Super pug grade, yeah. Done. I don't need your kudos. That's what the shit you put me to. How back? Um, a lure and a chest. Maybe those runes can give us a bit of history about this place. Well, I'm more worried about this big, beautiful <laughs> chest. Kind of like that one. How do I level these up? Do I have to pay? That can't be. It is. Oh, Mir. Ashes, ash to ash, bones to bone, where love cannot lie. Wait. Ash to ash, bones to bones, where love cannot live, death takes hold. Here are the words of Prince Dagger. My spear drips righteous and red from the blood of that cad, King Helgi. My father in his wisdom denied him the hand of my sister, Princess Seagrin, knowing his true and dark nature. Enraged by this slight, King Helgi gathered his forces and invaded our land, demanded to claim his bride. His murderous soldiers dipped their swords into the hearts of all whom opposed of it dipped their swords into the hearts of all who opposed their unclean union mother father all my brothers hunted down and slaughtered all because he was denied my fair sister the only male of my line left standing i impaled the, the villain helgi on my spear did my duty and avenged my family Look, the other half of the key. I knew those key pieces would fit. Can't wait to see what lock it belongs to.
changed everything here. I don't know where her vault is. She was crazy. King Helgi massacred her family just because he couldn't have her. Only her brother, Prince Dorga, survived to kill the Mad King. Sigrun and her brother had issues over that. Oh. And all the time Sigrun and I spent with each other. She never mentioned anything about this. Maybe she liked the way you saw her. I think it's funny that she's a Valkyrie now, too. Let me see. Whatever you need. Nothing appeals to you? Might put that on. I had Midgard something on.
How do I level it up? Oh! I follow the early bird special, the golden corral. I swear I hit the old lady. Oh! Yeah, I. Everything I think I. I think I like everything I have. Like the spray one, the the one that I have on right now. He's is my favorite. The axe one where it sprays, like how they add some new stuff and got a war where you aren't that one. I like some of the new stuff, but I like how they kept some of the old stuff too. Like when he takes his axe and he like sprays out that long stream of fucking ice. I love that. That's my favorite move in the game. It was my favorite in the original. It's how I killed all the Valkyries. How I see how to get to it. Hold on. game on the Valkyries. That's how I killed all my Valkyries. Is that where I need? No. It's over here. How strange. I've never seen that building before. Aye. Very strange indeed. Let's take a closer look. Wait. The 
shield that's blocking the entrance. It looks exactly like the one from Tyr's statue. It's another piece of Tyr's likeness sent flying across the lake. Ended up lodged right into this building, apparently. All this must have been hidden behind the ice until that shield smashed through it. Okay, I gotta find all of that, so... I hate that I don't have this yet. I wanna know what the fuck that is. It's gonna have something to do with that damn chest, too. I know it. Check this out. I don't know if you knew this, Maurice, but I'm gonna show you my trophies. Um. What? Oh, no, I was trying to do it. See how I started God of War Ragnarok on PS5? But it's making me do the PS4 one because the PS5 wouldn't, the sound wouldn't work right. I sure did defeat the nine Valkyries, retrieve all the treasures from the workshop center chamber, complete all the trials in Muspelheim, and that you have to do it twice. Read all the Jotnar shrines, use treasure maps to find all the dig spots, assist all the wayward spirits, obtain the ancient armor, obtain the travel armor, fully upgrade the blaze of chaos, fully upgrade the Leviathan axe. Fully upgraded at runic attack, kill all of the Odin's ravens, and the truth is, you only have to kill like 80, like, you don't have to kill them all. I think I have like 10 ravens left to kill, but you have to kill, I think, I think it's like 80, or I, I can't remember the exact number, but it's not all of them. Because I was like, I still have like 3 or 4 ravens left. I uh, collect all the artifacts, complete all of Brock and Sindri's favor, I freed all the dragons, killed a thousand enemies, slot enchantment in your, into your armor, craft an outfit for Atreus, fully upgrade my rage, fully upgrade my health, obtain a runic attack gem, upgrade a piece of armor, learn the languages of Muspelheim and Niflheim, fully explored, explored Vithregard, Explore all the Lake of Nine has to offer. Spread the ashes, defeat Balder. This is just a game. Rescue Atreus, heal Atreus. Yeah. Um, obtain all the, yes. She was hard, but I beat her. You can do it, buddy. You just gotta put your mind to it. That's all. I gotta do Dead Space. The only reason I, I don't have the Platinum for um, walk, The Walking Dead is because I haven't finished it. I still have to do the last chapter. So. Okay, so I'm gonna come out here. There's something inside. But we can't reach it with the shield there. Well, I gotta figure out how to move the damn shield. Doesn't look like you can brute force it. my house. 
possible for the workers and might as well do the same method user which is spray the axe. Well you do that. Make sure Atreus has the wolves equipped. If, if I was you, I would equip the wolves. Um, make sure everything's fully upgraded. Uh, make sure that all you, you have the best stuff on because my thing was I was going around and I hadn't upgraded any of my equipment or I hadn't upgraded things to better things and I went through and I upgraded everything could we climb the shield yeah we can but I'm talking so can you chill <laughs> giving you some advice, in case you didn't. Oh! <laughs> 
be useful. Could be my ass. About to see you. Well done. Now we just need to open the gate. arrows may help us freeze the gears oh that's right I forgot about that well done intentional oh sure <laughs> together again Mimir does this look like an abandoned treasury to you aye it does Secret's family crest Looks like a vault door to me. Now that we have both halves to that key, we should see if it matches that lock. Yeah, my rage is loud. There's two lore. in here. Ugh. Dead on the throne.
Prince Dogger. I can't believe he's still here. Prince Dogger? That the corpse of Seedrin's brother? How do you end up like that then? Freya, why won't you answer me? Why can't I read it? No, brother. You do it. Mm. There was, there never was a love as passionate and sordid as the one that took root between the fair Princess Sigrun and the foreign king Helgi. Helgi begged for her hand, but Sigrun's father, King Hogni, refused. And so Helgni raised a terrible army and descended upon her land, murdering all who opposed their union, king, queen, princes, all lay dead, all except for Seagrin's brave brother, Prince Dagger. Valiant Dagger took his spear and ran it through Mad King Helgi. When the princess discovered her lover dead by her brother's hand, rage blinded her. She did inflict a curse, and she did, wait, and she did inflict a curse on him most foul. But as her vision returned and she saw her entire family dead, she realized her mistake. It was too late. The curse on her brother had taken hold. From the depths of grief came heartbreaking regret, and her over and it overwhelmed her. In penance for her sins, she cast off her riches, title, and throne to dedicate her mind, body, and soul to the mighty Valkyries. A vow she did a vow she did make to tuck her heart away, for her love was too dangerous. Aww. It seems Sigrun put a curse on her brother for killing the Mad King. No. Truly? She did not know the Mad King had murdered her family. Once she did, it was too late. She had cursed her brother. That is why she joined the Valkyries. To atone. You knew all about Sigrun's family, didn't you, Freya? It was not my story to tell. What? Sigrun, a Valk the queen, the Valkyrie queen, was the most lethal opponent Atreus and I face in our prior adventures. Long ago, she was loved by Mimir, and clearly he remembers her warmly. But her utmost loyalty is to Freya, having aided her in restoring the warrior spirit and recovering her Valkyrie wings. Hey, learning all this only makes me love her more. She chose me despite my flaws, my regrets. Knowing she has some of her own makes me feel closer to her. I am glad to hear it. I'm gonna be mi- I think that lore on the wall I was supposed to read. Sup, my wife got me the new Resident Evil 4, 4 remake. Never played it. Haven't seen anything from the game either, so... So far, it's phenomenal. Awesome. I'm glad you're liking it, David. I I have it. I'm just not playing it until after I beat this and after I beat... Um, I'm going to also beat Super Mario 64. Okay, so that doesn't count. I got it. I didn't get to read that lore and it's driving me crazy. I don't know what it says.
another one of Devalin's diagrams. You spoke of his conscience. These pages are very old and could be anywhere. It is likely the relics outlined in these diagrams are very powerful. Hi. He saw that the Aesir would like. Okay, he that was powerful the... weapons to cut down his fellow dwarves. So he ripped out his design pages and scattered them. And what of him? Well, the All Father found out. He wasn't terribly pleased. Soon. I need to go ahead and get just do it. This is the right area, but we can't go further on the sled. Quiet. An abandoned camp. Whoever was here left long ago. What did you find? A list of provisions needed to prepare a meal. A recipe? Who left that way out here? Let's take a look at the ingredients. Perhaps the recipe will lead us to them. Thanks, David. Um, I appreciate that, but... Yo, girl, hope your family is well. That's really sweet. It's not the best at the moment. Um, there's a lot going on. I can't really... I don't want to really go into it. It's private. Um, but... Things will get better. Do they match the ones in that recipe book you found? I imagine we might find one of them. And they are starting to get better. They're just... It's taking its time. The ingredients around here. <clears throat> ah. I knew I recognized those initials. The Ballad of Yari and Soma. I'm not familiar. An old tale, but a good one nonetheless. The carving marks their passage through this realm. We could always try and find the others, if you're curious. I know where one of them are. I feel like I know where two of them are. Alright guys, I'm gonna end my live. I've gotta get up rather early and handle some business, but thank you for hanging out. We are gonna play. Actually, give me one second, I'll come back and we'll talk. I gotta pee. I've been going through these Dr. Peppers all day.
sorry. Wants to add me, so we're gonna. Um, so yeah, we'll work something out where we can play and stream together soon. Um, after everything that I've got going on at home calms down, we can, we'll fix, we'll figure something out. I really need to go to bed, but let's just go see what I'm about to do. I just hope the norms are somewhere indoors and warm. Safe to say, no, I have not missed Midgard in Fimble Winter. Thank you. <laughs> we will see soon enough. I gotta go in the middle. Might I suggest a ominous broken gravestone? Yes, you can suggest all you want, but I wanna look around. The hilt of a sword. Brother, I know that sword hilt. Tread carefully. You of all people know how weapons can carry ghosts. If it does not help us find the Norns, it can wait. Let's keep looking. This way. I feel a trace of their illusions here. I can try to dispel it. <laughs> No time to wander off, brother. Freya's found something. Oh, no. There's nothing here. A false trail. I'm afraid so. We'll have to see what else the wolves can find. Typical Nornish mischief. They know we're searching. I warned you they wouldn't make it easy. What's the hilt of a cursed king have to do with any of it? Distraction? Coincidence? Who knows? I suppose they'd say we were fated to find it. You use the sword hilt to unlock those grievances. I, I figured that when the gravestone dis disintegrated. We'll have to get a hold of you because I don't know how the stream is. You hit me up on PS5. Share your contact information. I'll give you an email. I'll message you, David, from my um, streaming page. <clears throat> I kind of, that's what, whenever it, the, the stone came together, I kind of figured that's what it was.
Good night, David. I don't know if I'm going to bed yet. I'm going to look around a little bit more. Oh, yeah. Follow the dog. <laughs> I was Citrin when you saw her last. She's still incorporeal ever since Kratos set her free of her corrupted form. But she hasn't let that stop her from helping any way she can. The truth is, I owe her more than I can repay. I doubt she'd see it that way. When we freed her, she could speak of little else but her reverence for you. Seeing you yourself again would surely be payment enough. Feel what exactly? Another illusion. It's coming from this wall. The Norns are hiding something. I knew it was that fucking wall. It looked funny. Oh, nah. <laughs> Nothing. Another dead end. A trap! to the wolves then Mitch you are so <coughs> what the wolves have picked up another trail are you too bougie to get in on that side oh you oh knock the hell out you crazy ass bitch I love that look I don't know why I just do I think it's fucking gorgeous I can't wait to get that thing and the that thingy, the thing that spits out of the wall, too. Claire, I'm ready for it. You mentioned that Thimble Winter had worn down some of Odin's curses, but you still needed help. Was it Sigrun who helped you recover your warrior spirit? Is that how Odin liked to refer to the curse that kept me from defending myself? Oh, I suppose that is where I had it. Would you like to know how that curse really worked? What it did to me? What it cost me to finally break it? I. I'm no longer sure that I do. That's correct. This is the place.
Damn it. <laughs> That's so much bullshit. Not connect it. <laughs> All 
Are you effing kidding me? You know what? Jesus. I don't even see the other one. There. Can you cut a way through the ice? Oh, are the norms making magical ice walls then? <laughs> no. I think the water just froze. How do I get to that? Sure, I'll have to come back down because <laughs> oh, this area just has that about it. <laughs> huh? You're fucking kidding me. Oh. another one. It's gonna have something to do with like an ice. I don't know. We'll see. I didn't tell them to be here. I don't know what the Norns did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. I saw a raven. Where did I see that?
thank you for your help. I know this was not your focus. The sooner we find your son, the sooner you'll be able to focus. I just hope it works. Just the same. Thank you. A fine sentiment, but write on a bloody note when we're out of the cold, brother. Brother, this way seems like a way out, not a way in. I concur. The Norns are further up. <laughs> you can suck my ass. I am trying to do something different. I concur, brother. She just fucking called mommy or brother. <laughs> We found it. Ah, isn't it always the third place you look? Okay, I'm gonna come back real quick because... Where are you going, brother? Freya thinks she's found the norms. Can you trust my judgment? I 
I don't know why he's a gentleman with her. I got it with Atreus, but like I don't get it with her. I haven't found um, like a piece of the map for over here. Is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made on wooden guards. Delightful. our own minds yet he certainly seems real enough i hate to tell you the parts in your mind will be real too that I don't have like the map for here. memory a rather hostile memory at that these fates should know I would not be deterred
This looks like, um, what's his name's memory, not mine. Freya of the Vanir. Master of Magic. Queen of the Valkyries. Witch of the Wolves. Wolf of Asgard. Destroyer of all she would hope to protect. Somebody to blame. She cannot change. Ouch. No one's gonna comment on Freya's bullshit, but she can comment on ours. All right. Let's Cannot change? See? You forgot smartest man alive! <laughs> well, certainly clinks like genuine Hacksilver. I suppose there's one small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Lemire. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. A phantom! The Norns have a phantom! Of course the Norns have a phantom! <laughs> This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. How do you know? That itchy sound again. Normally, I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear, but this is positively awesome. 
Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. I, how very dare you! Babbling! Oh, that looks official. Listen to me, please. Stop! Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here! Wait! Baldur, come back! Talk to me! This is all yours doing, mother! I am so sick of your constant mess! Imagine them thinking I had Never. any secret. Brother, hold off. Why did you never turn on Odin? But I did. I tried to stop him any way I could. Just lie! Holy fuck. You served Odin from the day you met him to the day he put you in that tree! You sought favor. You wanted his war. You wanted him mistreat everyone and everything. And you never gave a day until you turned on you. I know, Seagrin. It's true. All of it. But for love of you, I became a better man. A counselor for peace. An ally to all those who... Were you an ally to Freya in her suffering? To Scott? To Grover? Or to Tanya? No! You all took the side of the powerful death! You! Brother, watch out! There's more of them! Even now, you see a violent god in need, and you can't help but aid him and call him brother! It's who you always Who you are! And it's who you are! It is not her. No. Of course. You did what you must. Brother, the fiend! It's pulling me in! Mamir! Brother, help me! Monster! Atreus! I am coming! Why didn't you trust your own son? Don't let him take you! Atreus! Why must you see him the way he wants to be seen? I don't want to die! He's a murderer! That's all I have to do. And now he's mine. He killed the man! Atreus! I am here! I'm not safe with him! Son. His fear was that woman losing that woman, and his fear is losing his son. I think it's over. 
Did we pass the test? Didn't feel much like succeeding. I see the door has disappeared. Or it was never there. They toy with us still. What is that? A Kelpie. Don't see many of those in these parts. She must be theirs. Will she take us to them? I'll ask her. Hi. Okay, now it brings me... Easy, girl. Easy. That's right. It's a horse. Good. Care to talk about whatever the norms put you through? No. How come... I saw what they go through, but they didn't see what he went through. Get on. That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, no Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Unless it was disrespected. It walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother? Mm. There were the Hippocamps. They served the Sea God. I battled one upon a Titan. <laughs> that might not be her favorite subject. <laughs> the norns led us to a mystical horse mimir called it a kelpie it walked upon the water transformed and then dove down beneath the surface carrying us to the norms inner sanctum i expect our departure to be no less unpleasant may the norns make this journey worthwhile we're here fate's own hideaway never doubted we'd make it Gills. Look like, and then I gotta turn this off. Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head enter the home of the Norns tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son. son. <laughs> You know the child is an Asgard. No, you seek what all who search for us seek. To know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his uh, I don't brow know, Jesse. menacingly. Probably not. He resists. It's not my kind of game. Like, I don't like the game style. I just, it's just not my thing. But I am going to play RE4. I already have it. I don't have it. My brother has it, but he's going to let me use it. It's the urge to grunt. No, oh. oh, he fails. You come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts, as if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak, Speak plain. plain. <laughs> You will die, Kratos of Sparta. But you, but called, you called him, him the destroyer, destroyer of fate. fate. There, there must, must be a way, way to subvert, subvert destiny. destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. The protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There 
is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable. Merely make us seem prescient. When and my son was born, born shut up! <laughs> your prophecy said he would die a needless death. And he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did, it was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown, then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in Storycraft. We are, we are leaving. leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> he has to not go to Asgard. <laughs> if he doesn't go to Asgard, has faith in his son, he won't die. It changes the story. The fates of the realms. Their, no their names are Uro, Verandi, and Skuld. I do not know how I know this. Their meddling inside my mind is already proving difficult to recall, yet an uneasy feeling remains. No matter, I remember hearing Heindal is a threat to my son. That is enough. That was... educational. Let us leave this place. Happily. That's better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy... Will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh. Oh. Is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Mimir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. He looks so different out of the water. He 
Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure, we've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. <laughs> We're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe. The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norns. That's the wrong way up if you want to get out of here. <laughs> Let us find a gateway, return home, consider our plans. Listen, brother, before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake, though I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. I don't have any other missions. Norns have any good news for you? No. Ah. Maybe buying something expensive will take your mind off it? Can't believe we missed this. I'm here for you. Always a joy to work on these. Try not to break it.
Anything for Freya? Hope it's to your liking. Kratos? I'll heat up the forge. Till we meet again! I don't think I have anything else to do. That's better all the way around. Tell me of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is... Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Could I have a moment of your time? Oh dear, oh, dear. oh dear, what's to be done? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nethog has been slain. And as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of leaned words will be a walk in the park. Well, any questions before you travel on? About Nithog. You should know. We had no choice. 
It was Odin's doing. Oh, I am very well aware indeed of the alleged All-Father's role in this tragedy. Sadly, there's no expecting him to clean up after himself. Not all gods showed the interest that you do in righting past wrongs. Now please, take the capture device and see if you can find our missing lindworms. Should I have anything else for you, you'll be the first to know. But putting all that aside for the moment, is there anything else? Do you just like hearing the sound of the chimes? I suppose they do sound very pretty. They're all gone. Oh, there's one, two, three, four. Wait, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. You know, it's not enough to find a way to beat Heimdall. We also need a way to Asgard. <sighs> First tier. I have news. Oh. Did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall. The Norns did not say that Atreus would die by Heimdall. The Norns said that Heimdall wanted to kill Atreus, not that he would die. He just They just said that he wanted to kill him. They didn't say that he would kill him. He has no faith in his son whatsoever. First. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch Dropnir. Drop near. I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Drop near. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. How will this help me kill Heimdall? Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artists. But to even store Drop near, you need. Hi, Daniel! You were saying. So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. You'll know how hard the 
long to come. I have no idea. He said that forever ago. Oh, I'm gonna miss you, little one. Oh. <laughs> to everyone. He's Odin's left hand and he carries the horn that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we and should... And just as likely a trap because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Oh. Whew, that's a relief. <laughs> uh. Ow. Kratos, whenever you're ready. What's up with the ring? What is it? The lady. No idea what he's on about, brother. Honest, I don't like who I became on our last adventure. I can't be around the violence that follows him, that follows you both. I'm sorry. Wah. I'm ready when you are. I'm only just realizing all the little routines I've had to adopt taking care of Dropnir. I'll miss melting rings down for crafting gold, but I suppose we have enough to see us through to Ragnarok. <laughs> Too soon? So they were using, it makes more just like it. And they were, they had it down there. The real one was attached to a rope and then all the extras were just extras that they could melt down for gold. That's fucking a genius. See you out there. I kind of want to do, um... Ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh, no. This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. You I heard him. Quit your friend. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you shrimps think that'll keep us out we'll think the fuck again I'm enjoying it thoroughly what was all that then oh just Sindri trying to hog all the glory same old shit not that the gate what's wrong with a bloody gate 
Most likely someone in Nithavalir been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursion and you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates did never even think to look for. On account of being stupid. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service tunnel, direct to the forge. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorful. Brock! Brock! Unusual circus here. Elvish, I think. Yeah. There's a noir chest and the legendary chest down here, so. We keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Abandoned service tunnel. Yeah. <laughs> 
Kratos. I see something. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. I know, it's Sunday. <laughs> Another oil spill. <laughs> Ah, a fortuitous oil spill. I don't miss a trophy. There was one back there and I didn't get it. There might be a couple. Let me look around. Nope. I know there's one in here. I need to talk to Kratos.
Please listen. You have to. Can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But. Oh dear. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again! You're insinuating, and you know it! Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants can feel a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our opinion. These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. The sigil arrows should work with ice as well. was a bloody heartier sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. We'll need to get one of those gates open. I'd like to get both. <laughs> Oh, 
Ah, you've seen these troughs before, haven't we, brother? at Ragnarok. That is Tyr's job, not mine. It's plain to see Tyr's no war god anymore. Nor am I. I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't. Or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might lead. I am only protecting I my... I know. I know. And we both know the places protecting your child can take. Sigil arrows won't work on this. and I didn't like his new accent at all. Careful! Those Grim are possessed by nightmares. They'll be even more dangerous until we stun them. <laughs>
know, but they shouldn't have changed it. They should have left. If something's amazing, leave it alone. Open. Oh, I hope that's not the case. I, I'll just say this, that was highly disappointing. Up there! Rip voice is coming this way! Anything wrong with the disparity in size? Or number of limbs, say? Nothing in the world. You don't like the new accent either, Daniel? I don't, I'm not a fan. I mean, they could have found somebody that was closer. Like just a tiny bit closer? I don't know. There, now we can open the other gate. Why is it you ask? I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations. Nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? Do not presume to know what she wanted. I'm not saying anything you haven't thought. Her secrets haunt every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you talked about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talked to your son. I do not... So, I don't think they could have found, like, a perfect match, but they could have found somebody, like, a little bit closer to what he sounded like. This guy is just got completely different. His voice is just, I don't know. They went too far when they should have just kind of left it alone. You know what I mean? 
checked out. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put you on. You don't think she knew exactly what it meant, sending you to Jotunheim? This is mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. You're right. It's not for me to say. <laughs> all right. Let's get that wheel turning. <laughs> That's a start. Let me know if I can help you. Ah, teamwork. Like they could have, they could have found somebody better, closer at least. Is my thing. like a little bit closer? There had to be somebody that auditioned that was closer. Oh my God, there's two of them, and that I think. for some fresh air after that. Everyone thought so. It is close. I can feel it. Yeah! <laughs> 
I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And I know something about that. When we get out of here, I'll give you some space. Let you think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make this weapon, and to use it. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'll see what else I can learn while we're here. Maybe I'll send a few Ain Harryar back to Valhalla for good measure. Well, you have fun now. Hey, you made it! About time. I got everything all set here. Now we just gotta push on up to the fort. Falky! Oh, she left me. I don't mind stretching my legs. <laughs> Catch up with you any damn time. I Better take out that net. Here, where I was thinking. This up too? I'll have you know that was plugged when we found it. Sure it was. I 
Honey, you sure did go to pains coming here, busting old tear loose. What a prize he turned out to be, huh? Lucid enough when it's time to steal my kitchen, though. to that trick. Locals up ahead. Act civilized and hopefully nobody springs an alarm. No, quit your nattering, you snake sucking mommy milk sauce with your protective gear. Ain't you never seen a legend in the flesh before? Time for the makeup recently. Okay, looks like that oh. wheel up there opens the gate. Is <laughs> well, everything going on in my personal life? Like, like I said, I got a lot of dumb shit going on. Mm. No crap left. Why um. don't you look around and see if there's a way to lift this lift? <laughs> Makeup is doing my last concern. Now we're talking. Hang on, coming around. Brother, have you noticed the dwarves of the camp were twice as alarmed to see Brock than they were to see you? They did seem surprised. All right. Now I can turn this plane to cap that geyser there. You just give me the signal when you're ready. Now. On it! He is... Turn it! Copy that. We gotta have a full stop. Turn it again. Aye, aye. What? If the angle you need to find is down there, you just found it all. I don't know if I can make it fun while it's on us. Hey, I got the crank cover. You do the other. Ah, promising. Once more. Again. Hey, I 
got the crank cover. You do the other stuff. I don't understand what I'm supposed to be doing. What am I supposed to do? There's no pipes up here. That one over there? There's no pipes up here. That's why I was confused. Nope, I like the one I got better. Way more cool. Can ride on up to the forge. Come on, the lady's waiting. Hey, got another riddle for you. What gets bigger the more you take away from? It? Well, let's see. Something abstract, I expect. Appetite? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> stump the stump. <laughs> oh, isn't that clever? What well, gets bigger the more you take away from it? Didn't answer.
Thank you for the follow. I know what the answer is. because I knew the answer to that. I still had to look at I looked it up, but I knew the answer to that. I've heard it before, that's why. Ooh, that's brisk. Think I'll grab some for the lead. Grab some what? The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. Now, watch what? and learn! See? Dwarven magic's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. Understanding what? You... The nature of a thing's more important than the form of the name. <clears throat> Hang on! I smell trouble. Show me what you got! I thought he liked that other girl. Oh. D&D &D opens soon. I'm going to get some jelly filled donuts. Dunkin' Donuts opens soon. I'm going to get some jelly filled donuts. She has a cream cheese sandwich. Oh my god. You're making me hungry. Thank you for the follow! I think so. I'm not sure, but I think so. Oh, I gotta pee.
and Daniel me. I meet her since I was knee high to a note. But Sindri had never had it, said I. But today's finally the day. Woo! I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> Why, bro? I've never seen you so reverent. Are you nervous? What? Shut up. No, fuck you. <laughs> He's got a crush. Let me get past this part real quick, and then we're going to save it and turn it off, because I do got to go to bed. Well, I don't got to go to bed. I got to handle some private business and talk to my mama. Go! First try. That don't usually happen. This is beautiful. Imagine it in fucking... PS5. Turn the crank. Let's do this. It does not work. Huh? Thank you, Baba. What is it this time? Thanks for the follow. Out of the way. Let me look. Oh, fuck no. Do I gotta fix everything in this dang city, my Sindri. own self? I'm gonna need a couple of things. Follow me. Yeesh. This place ain't in some disrepair. It's disrespectful, I tell you. It's I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery stuff. You'll figure it out. This lady, what does she do? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. If we're real lucky, she'll give us her blessing. Doesn't give them to every piece. But the one she does, there's something to behold. The axe? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster, huh? Maybe sometime I'll spin you that tale. real quick and then I gotta I wanna finish this part Faye's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor damn fine woman she was apart from her taste in men of now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. Back in those days, I'd get so caught up in trying to be the best that I'd work till I plumb drop. Time goes by and there's less to prove. You learn to keep your own pace. Save your extra effort for when it's personal. Right for when you finally get to show the lady who you are. Wow, Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. It gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right. Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope. What do you mean, nope? Desire only grows when you take away the thing you desire. All right, it's not perfect, but let's hear your answer. Oh, you won't get it out of me that easy. Let's get back to business. One more crank to turn and it's onto the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to 
nature. I was almost following him for a moment there. We're good. Crank it. She's lighting up. She needs the final ingredient. The blood of a god. Give her your hand. Alfie Traitor almost forgot. Ma'am, it would be an honor if you might bless it for us. Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? <laughs> the fuck was that? She acts like I weren't even here. Mermaids don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. A part specifically you might be missing. Fuck. Fuck! Damn it, Sindri, you lion's cat scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! The fuck you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no, I can't bless shit. I don't have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters. Not at all.
this weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. You know I can't let you take our new gal home without giving her a twirl. Look, we got volunteers. <laughs> that sounds up. Ain't your first time with the spear, I reckon. It is the first weapon I've fought to learn. What hell? Ain't this just like old times? Put it more accordingly myself. What did you pay? Think maybe you want to try out that new spear or what? Throw it all you like. Drop narrow, make more. <laughs> what you said back there. It's good to have friends when you find out your brother's a rack scabbing liar. No doubt he only wished to protect you. Weren't his call to make. The guy dies, he's got the right to know about it. Take heart, Brock. We all die sometime. Many of us more than once. No, never mind all that. We gotta finish putting the spirit through our paces. Come on! Might have to get creative up ahead. Gotta hurry. I 
see there? You start to recognize when there's a weak spot? Setting off a spear in anything like that's a sure way to alter your circumstances on the right. the more you take away. Ah, uh, is it time? Because the more removed from events you become, the larger their scope in your memory. No, that's bollocks now that I say it. But never mind. Today's all right. <laughs> favor to ask of the both of you and we can call a square what happened down there in the forge with the lady that's my story to tell all right agreed oh very well
I get over there. Might have went too far back. circumstances on the right quick. <laughs> Because the more removed from events you become, the larger their scope in your memory. No, that's bollocks now that I say it. Never mind. <laughs> Today's I didn't all like right. the merchant voice, that's it. Them eyeballs are taking over them ground. We better beat them out. Go! Ah! Hey! Call oh, no! Well, that was creepy. Ready for your next lesson? Take note of that there, watch him, my hoot. Get a decent angle and fling a spear into it head on. It's all about the proper angle with those puppets. You want it straight on. Now, I'm telling you, you're too far to the side. Good! Guess you get extra credit. What if he 
hold children. Put you in the trap. Great. You got him. Oh, hello there. Sorry. Didn't mean to scare you or anything. You did not. Right. Uh, you can bring that back to Ratatoskr. Whatever you're ready. with the lady that's my story to tell Arnold. but he shouldn't if it's a remake he should be the same you know what i mean he should be the same age and everything just like leon should be the same age everything i just don't i miss the old merchant voice right i agreed well for a period of time perhaps uh, mamia oh very i'll play it to die Bruce. well i missed that <laughs> These ugly birds. Maybe those grim will take him down. sit in the living room. I brought your Oculus in from Uncle Jack, so if you want to go play it, you can. Are we going to have today? No, it's tomorrow. Oh. Ah! Uh! back after I got over here. I was screwed and I didn't get all that stuff over there, so that's why I came back. I don't understand what was the point of that, though. Like, it didn't do anything. Oh, 
how to keep them off the walls. Okay. Straight it is. Ooh. Reckon I see how you'll be getting down from up here. Best I find my own way back. Been too auspicious a day to end it orkin and borkin. I had something to do. Wait, feels like there was something else. to do that when I can do this one. Why is my weapon showing like I can upgrade something when I can't? Hitting the road or chewing the fat? Is that the way down? And I'll get those gates working for you! I only hope Sindri's in one piece by the time Grok's done with him. The ice beneath those two is thin enough under the best of circumstances. Chest, but I don't know where it's at. I never came across it. Where is everyone? Now a good time. I just want to talk. Dad to dad. Speaking of which, imagine my surprise when Atreus came knocking at my door. <laughs> He's doing well, by the way, and will continue to do so just as long as I return to Asgard sometime soon. You make me so jealous, I'm hungry. Besides, our friend here has a, has a whole lot to live for. Arguable. Run along now, but behave yourself. <sighs> New spear. Never much cared for Brock. Can't deny the dwarf's talent. You came to speak. Speak. You don't really want more. Do you, Kratos? All that blood on your hands, on your son's hands. I want peace as much as you do. Perhaps we can find it together. He's lying. I know. That boy of ours. He's everything I expected. So clever, kind, 
Are you sure he's yours? The kid. You really ought to be very proud. He is the key to peace in our age, to break free from all this fate and prophecy. My son is not your key. Oh, God, do they not have metaphor in your homeland? Or rather, did they? I'm sorry, that's not fair. I know you're not the god you once were. And now is your chance to prove it. Return my son, or you may meet the god I once was. And what kind of god is that, Kratos? What do you even know of godhood? In your lifetimes, has anyone ever worshipped you? Ever prayed to you? Can you even imagine that kind of love? No! You don't care about mortals. You don't care about anything beyond yourself. Beyond the monster who kills without cause. You fear what you can never even hope to understand. Is it any wonder that your boy is in no rush to come back to you? Don't listen to him, brother. He's just trying to get in your head. <clears throat> Fucking dead. I've never had him showing up yet. At least you rattled him as much as he rattled you. Get experience once she ain't even fucking here. Good timing. Let's see what Brock made you. One with the powers of Dropnia. Well, come on. We can discuss it on the train. I do worry, though, if I'm being frank. We've crafted a weapon to kill a god. One could say you're on the verge of returning to form. Does it scare you, aiding another violent god? I'm scared for you, brother. That spear could start a war. THE war. If that no longer concerns you, then maybe Freya's right. Maybe the Giants had you in mind all along. As long as you remember we can't get home this way, we'll need to take the train down. This noir chest. Oh, I know where it's at. Another carpet from Yari and Sonia. I thought it was over here. There's probably another ingredient around here, brother. It is an ingredient from the recipe. How did they reach this realm? Oh, they were well versed in realm travel. You see, Yari was raised a Midgardian warrior. Meant to fight in the family's war. Find a wife. Die for glory. But he rejected it. He left. He followed his own path. I wouldn't be surprised if we found their mark in other realms as well.
fair. I assume it was Seagram then who helped you retrieve your Valkyrie wings. Were they hidden in the place I guessed? They were not. But yes, she did. Argued all the while I should let my anger go. But help me just the same. There's something I'm not seeing. Where's my phone? Aww. The forge. I need to find that last tote pole. Okay, that one, that one. Right there. Freya, where is Seagram now? Impossible to say. She's on a mission spanning the realms in search of our lost sisters. Our hope is that she can bring their incorporeal spirits to Vanaheim. We can find a way to restore them to uncorrupted forms. I'm going to end my live here. I love you guys. I'll see you guys later. Got a lot to do. Um, but yeah. Good night. Hope to see you guys tonight. If not, I'm sorry. Got a lot going on. Like I said, we'll get back to a regular schedule sooner or later. Bye.